Hi, we are the Grants Works sub team and we are a part of Going Global. I'm Maggie, I'm a junior civil engineering student. I'm Sanjay, I'm a sophomore majoring in environmental engineering. And here we'll give you an overview of what we've done this semester. So as we said in the symposium presentation, we're the grant team and our objective is to receive grant money for Alcacar's various sub teams. Um, we do this primarily by looking at past EPA proposals and incorporating that work into our current work. This semester, we decided to switch our focus away from an overall PF200 design to a PF200 filter redesign. Um, uh, we had a consultation meeting with Monroe and we spoke to a past PF200 member, Whitney, um, and we decided that that was our best chance of obtaining grant money for the sub team. Um, so a summary of the filter design, it had a number of issues which were causing sand to escape from the filtration system um, under a certain operation conditions. Um, so this redesign aims to fix those issues and enable the success of the PF200 overall. Um, some of the solutions we plan to implement are a gravity exclusion zone and also various methods which aim to reduce the amount of pressure which is going through um, the water as it goes through the water treatment process. So uh, next would be uh, basically what the EP phase one proposal would look like. There will be a project summary, which is the abstract, and we basically completed it already this semester. Um, the next section would be the proposed research. And as Sanjay has mentioned before, we, will, uh, we decided to focus on the redesign filters that will be implemented in the PF200 plant. Um, and uh, to, and the, some of the current issues is that there is sand escaping and there are clogged slotted filters um, in the current filter. So uh, uh, we will try to create gravity exclusion zones to increase the area and thus decrease the velocity so sand does not fluidize or try to find a way to decrease pressure from transitioning from backwash to the filtration mode to decrease the uh, velocity. Um, the design of a new filter could cause less clogging and could be easier maintained and would not face the problem of sand escaping. And the next uh, part of the proposal is the relationship to the challenge. And this is a gravity powered plant, which would be very beneficial to uh, a lot of people. And the next uh, part of the proposal would be the education interdisciplinary aspects of research. Uh, we, after we implement this to PF200 plant and it proves to be successful, we can implement it to other water treatment plants and uh, sort of replace the stacked, uh, the rapid filtration system, which has a lot of clogging problems. And we could also teach the communities the importance of water treatment and the water cycle and team members uh, on how community team members on how to operate the water plant. As for the project management, uh, we uh, provided a schedule uh, for how the plan will be implemented and it will be finished within the next semester, uh, so spring 2021. This semester, we trimmed down the EPA proposal as much as we could. And as we mentioned before, we focused it on the filter instead of the entire PF200 plant. We felt that uh, it would be less confusing for the people who would read it. Um, as for the budget, Monroe suggested that we could have a summer stipend um, to spend a bulk of the money. But since the filter is projected to be finished within next semester, that might be an issue. Um, so we'll try to find other ways to spend the $25,000 of the grant. Um, we will continue to work with the PF200 team before the semester ends to sort of get a rough idea of what type of materials they need, any other ways we could find to like spend the money and the budget. Um, so here are just the next steps that our subteam plans to engage in for the rest of the semester. So we have to reach out to current members of the PF200 team in order to finalize our budget um, amount for the proposal. 
and make sure that the EPA proposal accurately reflects the research that we've done on the filter. And then we'll continue to develop the rest of the proposal and work on the EPA phase one um, application um, by February in order to get the funding. And once we've finished all of that, if we have any time left over, we'll make sure to look at other research opportunities for other sub teams to receive grant money for the project team. Um, that's if all. There are, if there are any questions and recommendations, feel free to reach out to us. Our emails are listed below. Thank you.